Okay, I'm dealing with my raspy voice. It was my feet. Okay. Two white compounds. I have ammonium thiocyanate, and I have also strontium hydroxide. These two chemicals, okay, are we mixed together. This is going to be crazy. I showed you exothermic, and I'm going to show you endothermic. Craziness, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour them together in a beaker. Before I do so, though, the speaker that I'm talking about, I want to clean off my, uh, clean off this compound. So what I'm going to do is, as I lose my, uh, just put some water on here, okay? Again, if they find us some other time, it'd be kind of cool, okay? Be like, what was that sound? So, take some water, okay? I'll just leave it like that. Come back to my two compounds. I'm going to mix them. Yeah, I can try to move the camera. Someone get the camera for me. So I'm going to take my two compounds. Someone grab that camera. I need that beaker as well. You're the best in your area. Okay. And these are my little cherubs. Say, hey. Okay. So in any case, my beaker here. And, oops, I'm on my camera seat. Oh, they're good. You're awesome. A little focus. Okay. So now, I'm going to add my two chemicals. It was nice knowing you. Okay, guys. <sighs> Craziness. Okay, now I'm going to stir. Like no tomorrow. Okay, so as I stir... Any changes you see? Did I pour in the same compound? Hope not. That would really stink. Yes, I did. Okay. I didn't grab the right two. Alright, now we're now we're now we're now we're freestyling. Okay, hold on. I was so prepared I wasn't. Okay, so. Let's add another compound. Stay with me. Can you take this off for me? All right, here we go. Yep. Saran wrap is a... Okay, so here we go. Two different compounds now. I'm going to stir. Of course, we should see some changes because now I have two different chemicals. Do you see anything? Blue. Um, close. <laughs> What's happening, party people? Get a little closer there. Miss B. What do you see? Anything changing? Looks like a lot flakier. A lot flakier? Uh, well, I'll tell you this. It smells like ammonia. Uh, so what's happening? Is it still the same... I'm guessing the stoichiometric ratio now because I poured in the wrong ones. Just stay with me for a second. It's craziness, right? You smell that ammonia, don't you? You just you're just saying yes because you're being nice. I think we need a little more more of the. Uh, oh yeah, that didn't all come out, did it? Now we're talking. Now, this is endothermic, yeah. Don't go anywhere. I'll write you passes. Okay, maybe a little more of this. Now it's getting mushy. Getting very mushy. Okay, now. While you're getting mushy, just tell me something's happening. Stay here for a second. So clearly something's happening, right? For those that can't smell, you can't smell the ammonia. But this is clearly mushy. Now we got what kind of, what kind of like a paste. 
like a slurry. Everyone see that? Okay, so now, that was my endothermic reaction. Not too sexy. Just give me 10 more seconds. So when you look at it closer, you say, that was pretty boring. We may say, well, Mr. Grotsky, that's pretty lame. Okay? And, but if you, if you were to feel it very carefully, feel it, feel it end. I'll hold this. Can you do two things? It's cold. It's very cold. Why is it cold? It took energy from the environment in this endothermic reaction. Now, it took so much energy from its environment that the water transferred its energy to the chemical. And if that's the case, if the water exothermically gives up its heat, what does it become? Right. So, if you look carefully, Have a great day, everybody.